Hello and welcome to weekly financial modeling tips by the Startup Station. Today we're going to model a podcast strategy. This is a very common channel. A lot of people are going in podcasts to spread the word, to raise awareness about what they're doing, to become thought leaders. So how exactly do you do that? So what we want to determine here is how many customers we can get from this strategy. What we need to figure out is the following. How many times do you think you're going to appear on a podcast per month for years one to five? This will come from your marketing strategy, uh, maybe a PR firm. You want to think about um, what are the podcasts on which you want to appear and what is the average number of listeners per podcast that you can expect to reach every time. If there is a wide range of podcasts, I would take a medium, right? I would exclude any outliers so that you are only working with averages. This is a very important concept in financial modeling where you don't want to um, aim too high. You don't want to aim too low. You want to be conservative and you want to work with averages. And finally, you want to think about the conversion rate from listeners to customers. Again, if you don't have any data, just like we did in our previous videos, you want to look at the norm. Uh, if uh, a given podcast releases any data, that's great. Otherwise, just look at this channel and, if possible, the industry cross-channel intersection and use that as an estimate of the performance you may expect to get. Okay. So let's see how we're going to get this done. So here we have our assumptions in blue. We're assuming 12 podcast appearances per year or one appearance per month. Obviously, we can do anything we want. So actually, just for the sake of it, let's change this to zero and let's change this to two just to see how um, it's going to be reflected in modeling. We're assuming uh, 25,000 listeners per podcast, so um, a pretty popular podcasts and a 10% conversion rate from listeners to app users, right? So let's see how we're going to model that. So first we need to uh, calculate our total reach per month. So we're going to take the total number of appearances and multiply it by the listeners per appearance. Again, we're going to anchor it so that we can piece this formula along. Okay, and you see that in the month where we have two uh, appearances, we have 50,000 listeners that we've reached. Okay, so then we're going to calculate how many um, uh, users we've got. We have our conversion rate, right? This is 10%. Uh, let's anchor this so that we can piece that along. Okay. And uh, the number of uh, new app users is going to be the floor function, right? Um, and then we're going to multiply the total number of listeners times the conversion rate and round it to um, zero decimal points. We're doing it so that we're not allowing any partial users. Okay, and then notice that this strategy does not have a marketing budget because typically this would be what is called earned media. This is something you're going to earn or it's going to be procured by your PR agency. And so it's going to be covered through a different mechanism that a direct marketing budget. So this is it. Thank you for watching. Please comment below if you like this video, share with your friends and other founders. Sign up for this YouTube channel to get more weekly financial modeling tips every Tuesday. And if you want to learn our unique framework for modeling early stage ventures, sign up for our masterclass. The link is in the description. Thanks again, and I'll see you next week. Bye.